formerly called the National Research Council, the Council for Scientific and Industrial Research, CSIR, is the foremost national science and technology institute in Ghana. It was established in 1953. The CSIR has 13 research institutes and over 60 field stations across the country. As part of its visit to summer agencies under the Ministry of Environment, Science, Technology and Innovation, the sector minister, Dr. Kwekwe Friye, was at the CSIR in the Ashanti region to acquaint himself with their operations. He visited the CSIR's four institutes, which comprise of the Crop Research Institute, the Forest Research Institute, Soil Research Institute and the Building and Road Research Institute. I'm very excited because of the potentials that I see. As for the knowledge, the manpower base and what not we have, the most important thing is getting our act together, putting things together. And that is the being of Ghana. We have everything. The Director General of CSIR, Professor Victor Ajiman, said to be able to carry out its mandate effectively, the CSIR needs adequate funding to meet up with the new technological advancements in the area of research. Dr. Kokwe Friye tags the Institute under the CSIR to come out with research work that will respond to the needs of society. At the Building and Road Research Institute, Dr. Friye urged the public, particularly real estate developers, to patronize the Pozzolana cement produced by the Institute, which cost less. He assured the Building and Road Research Institute of government support towards its work. At the Crops Research Institute, its director, Professor Moses Mochia, mentioned some challenges facing the Institute, especially in the area of developing agricultural innovations. Whenever the variety is released, it is given to MOFA and they give it straight to farmers. So they don't trace it back to uh, CSIR. So most people do not know the value of uh, CSIR. The director of the Forestry Research Institute, Professor Daniel Ofori, told the minister that the National Tree Seed Center has been established at the Institute to produce and supply high-quality seeds and seedlings for all indigenous and exotic tree species. He said the seeds and seedlings are available for sale. At the Soil Research Institute, Dr. Afriye was taken through a technology that has been developed by the Institute to address soil degradation.